report of golf ball size hail in the city of Gadsden. Uh, the tornadic part of the storm, though, is south. And look at that. So it looks like we have a draft, uh, maybe a debris ball, if nothing else, a strong hook echo that's uh, north of Jacksonville. It's um, south of Hoax Bluff, and that's going to clip the eastern end of Etowah County. It'll probably move up into Cherokee County, too, and there's really no sign of that thing weakening. And uh, a lot of other severe weather events that we've had recently, there was uh, cool Alabama, but that's not the case this time. Uh, we don't have anything that would really slow this down other than maybe topography uh, in the eastern sections of the state. So uh, as it interacts with some of that terrain, some of the terrain features, the higher mountaintops in Etowah County, Calhoun County, and Cherokee County, there may be some, uh, some flux in that. But given where that hook is, James, that looks an awful lot like where the uh, Palm Sunday tornado we had gone based on radar. It's reminiscent of that. Uh, and again, you're, you're watching damaged images from our viewers and video down in one box. You're watching the ongoing severe weather in the day. So what I want to do is let's take me full. All right, folks, we're going to be uh, we're going to be at Gadsden here real soon, continuing to follow along with this thing. Real tough terrain here to catch a glimpse of it. Sorry about that. There's nothing I can do about it. Alabama. Really can't wait. Wait to get back to the plains, folks. Cannot wait to get back to my home. But you know, I'm not a big fan of chasing in the jungle, and uh, we got some options in Gadsden. Let's see if we can exercise those and uh, get ourselves into a good, good situation. Hearts and uh, our, our prayers and thoughts go out to the folks in Tuscaloosa and uh, around the Birmingham area and all those locations uh, along the track of this this amazing, amazing supercell that is tracked from Mississippi all the way now uh, approaching Georgia and will probably continue to track, you know, for several more hours uh, producing tornadoes along its track. We, okay, I got a glimpse of the base now. It's just off to my south. I got to get around this guy. We're definitely, we're definitely in an area where we can catch back up with this thing, if we can uh, get some cooperation with the drivers and, and the road situation, and hopefully the thing is not uh, too uh, bad. Things aren't too bad in Gadsden. So, I tell you, one of the most uh, you know, gut wrenching things for me was seeing that, that children's swimming pool there on the side of the road, all all crumpled and you know, yeah, just that, that kind of drives it home right there, folks. You know, lives are. are we're literally falling out of the sky on me for, you know, about 45 minutes, pieces of, uh, you know, people's lives, possibly as far away as Tuscaloosa coming down, raining down from the heavens. Just uh, really a sad, sobering, unreal situation. And, but when you get these supercells that produce these what I call mega tornadoes, and, and we knew that would happen today, it's, it's been well advertised. I posted on it on Facebook several, several days ago, knowing, you know, we knew that Wednesday would be the, the peak of this thing and in a very uh, populated region that it's not easy to see these things. We knew that we would have some uh, a terrible situation today and you know it just uh, it happened and that's that's nature it's it's our volatile atmosphere that we have that thankfully if we did not have this atmosphere we would not be able to live on this earth. Um, we're actually too close to the sun. It would be too hot for us to live. So thank God we have our atmosphere. But, you know, this atmosphere fights to keep itself in balance constantly. And it's that fight that the atmosphere puts on with itself, uh, with nature, that, that produ produces these violent events. And we got to remember, these violent events are here for a reason. They're, they're here to keep us balanced, our, our, our atmosphere balanced and, and 